If you take 5-HTP, today we're going to be talking about the dosages that you should be taking, the side effects that come with 5-HTP, but also how long does it take before you start seeing the effects of having 5-HTP, the benefits that come with it. But the other things that we're also going to be talking about is really the drug interactions and other interactions. You're definitely going to want to stick around. Hi, I'm Dr. Legrand, and so let's dive right into it. So really first talking about the dosages. How much should you be taking of 5-HTP if you're considering it? Well, let's talk about first what the professionals talk about, what the research says, and then what I think and what I actually recommend to my patients and clients when I do recommend 5-HTP. Very first thing is a lot of professionals, what they will say, or if you go on WebMD, it will say anywhere from like 200 to 800 milligrams a day is safe to take. Now, that being said, what I've seen in the research where I see when they are testing for 5-HTP, whether that's to help benefit for sleep or anxiety or for depression, typically they will also be taking about 200 to about 400 milligrams a day. So that is a very good ballpark as far as when you are going to be taking Now, What I recommend is definitely to play it more on the safe side, is start on more of the lower dose of doing 200 milligrams a day. See how that goes, especially as your body is starting to take it. Then bump it to 400 milligrams. And if you start seeing the benefits and you want a little bit more benefits, you can definitely bump it up to 800 milligrams. But of course, check with your doctor first, because we're gonna talk about certain interactions here in just a minute when it comes to different medications, when it comes to 5-HTP. But first, you really Need to know the side effects when it comes to taking 5-HTP and there's quite a bit especially if you're going to do higher doses and that I don't recommend. Some people have taken up to one gram to up to six grams and that is definitely something I do not advise because you definitely run into a lot of these different side effects such as heartburn, stomach aches, nausea, vomiting as well as even with muscle spasms and even on the lower dose I see this pretty common even for myself sometimes is you can feel a little bit drowsy if you might be just taking even up to 400 to 800 milligrams a day where you can start feeling drowsy. Now, of course, this is due to because what 5-HTP does, it does help increase levels of serotonin. It makes you feel really happy, but in some other cases, it can also make you feel more anxious because it's going to play another effect of things such as dopamine, which I also will talk about here later. Now, the other thing you have to really keep in mind when you are taking 5-HTP is it does interact with definitely certain types of medication. 5-HTP is certainly one of the type of supplements and nootropic that I find in research that have been shown that it does interact with medications versus a lot of the other types of nootropics and different supplements that are out there. But 5-HTP is one you have to be careful with. And the ones that it does tend to interact with is a lot of your antidepressants. So your SSRIs, your monamine oxidase inhibitors. It also does interact with a lot of different stimulant medications. So if you're on any ADHD medications, is something you need to double check with your doctor to make sure that there is no kind of contraindications going on here. On top of that, it has shown to interact with medications medications like cardiodopa, tramadol, as well as triptans, which are types of medications that help with migraines. So if you're taking any kind of migraine medications, you definitely need to be careful with taking 5-HTP. Now, one of the biggest questions I get asked all the time is how long can I take 5-HTP? I get this asked a lot about different supplements and what I have seen as far as the research goes, there's not a whole lot of research that tells us how long you can really take it. Professionals say, you know, you could safely take it for a year of taking 400 milligrams a day. I've even seen some professionals say, you know, you could take it in very small dosages for three years and that's fine. But there's not really enough long-term studies as far as 5-HTP because where a lot of the research has shown is typically they are having them take it anywhere from six to 12 weeks. Now, what I say here is you have to be careful on a couple things here. Is one, you gotta understand what 5-HTP is doing. 5-HTP, like I said before, is building serotonin levels. Now, that being said, we have seen in research that 5-HTP depletes catecholamines such as dopamine, norepinephrine, epinephrine, and these are all very important for people who especially have ADHD and other mental health issues. And if you are keeping depleting that and not overcompensating that with maybe a different types of different amino acids, then you're gonna run into some problems because what happens if you are taking this long-term and soon as it does deplete your dopamine, and epinephrine and norepinephrine levels, you will find that 5-HTP will not be effective anymore. You will not see the effects of it. So the real question you have to ask yourself, and as far as what I say is, 
One, you should get some kind of testing done. Check your amino acids, see if you really do need to be taking something like 5-HTP to begin with, or if you do have low dopamines to begin with already, maybe you shouldn't be taking something like 5-HTP. But if you are needing to take something like 5-HTP, then you really need to decide as far as if you're balancing out with other types of amino acids to overcompensate, help improve your dopamine levels, but as well as improving your serotonin levels at the same time. Typically what I'm doing with my clients and patients is, you know, that six to 12 weeks is a good time frame where research has kind of shown that they can see the effects of taking 5-HTP to helping with depression, anxiety, and in some cases with also ADHD. But over time, I'm usually wanting to use food as medicine, so we're not relying so much on the 5-HTP, but just help pretty much a patient or client get the boost that they need to balance their body chemistry numbers until they can get their diet in order and their other lifestyle changes in order so they don't have to rely on the 5-HTP. So the big question that you are really asking is how long does it actually take to see the effects of taking 5-HTP? I get this asked a lot and honestly what the research has shown it says it usually can take anywhere from four to up to 12 weeks before you actually see the effects and the benefits that come from 5-HTP because it takes time to get into your system to actually start seeing those benefits. But if you really wanna see this in action, I actually did take 5-HTP for 30 days to see if actually these benefits do actually improve on my own benefit. So you should watch this video right here where I took it for 30 days so you can understand how long it took for me to get the benefits and also what were the side effects and the experience I had. So watch this video right now.